they fighting with each other? It's all right. We got a game now, so. I cool. you want to go for it? Ah, uh, they're going in. We'll look after. Playing a game. So uh, we just saw in. Cypher Phoenix play, right? Just a little bit ago. We did, and we saw Cypher Phoenix learn something mid-set, uh, <laughs> and hopefully he's going to capitalize on this. I do think Two Saint will punish his standstill up smashes, and I think that'll be the big difference. So there's that was the second time this stock the up smash on shield and it looks like Toussaint was a little reluctant to go for a rest um, I think he wants a lead I don't think he wants to, to just trade it looks like a it mistake it's scary because he got such a big percent lead too yeah. to start it off yeah I, I don't know if I agree because having this I don't know Toussaint knows much more <laughs> than I and maybe he just missed the input or whatever but Cypher Phoenix continuously looking comfortable in this matchup um it's really a balance of making sure the Puff doesn't feel comfortable enough to set up to set up how Puff wants to set up. Just generally center stage, creeping in with back airs and threatening your space. Yeah, there's like a 75th percentile in like a sphere going around all the platforms that you want to stay in. That's a good way and to then there's it. a pillar going from the middle all the way above the middle platform, <laughs> all the way up to the ceiling that they want to be in. <laughs> it's interesting. I could, I could see it, and I, I, I see what you're talking about. Um, I think the, the big the thing, zone. the big thing mentally in this, this is a best of three, right? So you yeah, really have yeah, yeah. you have a lot of opportunity to throw Toussaint off of his rhythm quickly, and then oh, yeah. then capitalize. Um, right now, it looks like he's getting caught up in his movement. So this is this is strong Toussaint momentum right now until Cipher can can start doing things. I want to see some ledge dashes. Oh yeah, it's yeah. something I'm not conscious of when I'm playing, but watching it. You know when they're not ledge dashing as much as most people. Yeah, I, I don't hate the decision not to. Well, oh, that was a clean. Yeah, that was good. Because honestly, against players now, there we go. and especially against players that are that from good. this region that have hacks experience, um, you have to really train yourself to, to counter play ledge dashes, so they become less effective. That really is hacks. Like uh, it's a pure hacks thing. That, that's trickled down to the entire metagame of this region. But I guess it's a it's a worldwide meta as well. Mm. Good follow up, and just like that, Cypher Phoenix is like he's about to be down two stocks. He's, he's really oh, uh, let well, things I don't want to do get back here. Oh, just he's getting caught up outside. in movement. Look, you you got to make sure that you are more comfortable than Puff at any stage. Even if you're not hitting yes. them actively, even if you're just getting cheeky back move here around and there, it better than that. You need to be moving. Unless you're Luigi, you got no excuse. See? Look at that. Just a little movement. Oh, got him a grab. He had the right read, but way too early. And I like his decision to laser. Um, I could talk about this for days, but lasering when they're already at a high percent is really good because then you start killing them with like random things. Weak nair, weak back nair. Um, getting strong nair unlocked is, is a big deal too. Yeah, the, I, we've seen a lot of soft bears. <laughs> yeah. Uh, starting in that ditto. All right, good, good. Gets the ledge. It's kind of lucky. Two Saints hitbox miss. Just clipping with so the nair. Quick, so quick yeah. to the nair dash attack. Yeah. Two Saints and Big Kid it. both. It's really interesting how they've begun using nair. Like, Big Kid would used to use nair so much, and he actually slowed down a little bit on, on the usage. Um, and Two Saint has just been using it as part of his toolkit so well um, that I remember because me and, me and Toussaint kind of came up together and specifically that move was one move that um, I just remember when he started really, really implementing it more and more. Nair rests. Uh, uh, Nair, Nair rest dash setups. attack is, is huge right there at certain percents. Oh, misses the Nair entirely. Yeah. It's also just good as a... Oh, okay. <laughs> misses the stock entirely. Toussaint laughing <laughs> off though. Yeah, that was uh, that was pretty bad. Is there is there a strong hit of Buff Snare? Is it just the same hit all the way through? I think there is a strong hit. It's just not that much different. That's a great question. I'm not sure. I think it is. I think uh, there, the stronger there has hit. To be a strong I hit. think the strong hit does like more percent and does like slightly more. It must back. not be out for very long. Nope. Because you never see it. And they only want the soft hit. Unless oh, you're like edge guarding. Oh no, missed the jab. Yep. It's bad. Yeah, I mean. Past the SD, Cypher Phoenix is still looking good. 
looking like he wants he wants a small area. Yoshi's is weird, man. In this matchup, Yoshi's is um I don't think it's as good as people think. Got it. Can that was sick. That nice. was that was a and short ledge. onto random. And just two quick ones. That, two so. quick ones right there. Laser. Bam. Shine. Oh, he, bad read on the up smash. He's still any any good hit right now to take the stock. It's, this is a, a terrifying spot to be in. Love that. Threaten with some up airs, some short up up airs. Take space slowly, and then yeah. an up tilt. Kind of caught by surprise. Randall? Uh, but Cypher Phoenix up a, up a clean stock. Um, hey, no, obviously obviously capable of bringing this back. But every every hit he takes is just that I, much more. I swore that dangerous. I saw him put out a forward there instead of an air, and I think he would have got both hits. Oh yeah. I like it always looks like it's a, a mistake when like someone puts out an air or a forward air. Right? Ultimate's Stumbled got some crazy. <laughs> I, I just keep getting distracted by this ultimate. Hype. Dude, they keep screaming. Yep. <laughs> it's a big venue. These legend dashes are getting cleaner and cleaner. So you're saying just climbing back. If he gets his edge guard, he's going in. Ahead. Good leg. Made a read that he'd go straight. Didn't work out, but not punished yet. We'll see if Cyber Phoenix can take the stock. No. Oh, wow. So Tuesday, right. Tuesday looking okay. Cyber Phoenix really needs to, um, I think, slow things down. Take a few more percent. Trade hits. He just he has has to, to, he has to touch he's gotta percent. maintain this lead. Almost got that jab reset. There we go. Okay. That's what he needed. So just a, a few frames off of jab reset rest. It's a tie game. Now Tucson has to fight a little bit harder, but still looking better than he was last stock. I think he's a little bit more eager to close out this last stock, so he's going to be throwing out aerials to attack on percent and not really worry about maybe even losing this stock if he can get up to 10 percent real quick. Yeah, let's, let's see if his discipline kind of holds together here. <laughs> he just does it. Oh, Big round was Mars, but did, he, did Mars just get upset? I believe so. I don't know. I can't tell. Can't tell. But don't care. Two Saints about to lose this game, man. If he gets up smash, it's over. That angle. That was a, a crazy angle. Call that a crangle. A crazy <laughs> angle. You should patent that. That's. That's it. <laughs> what are you patent it? I can't even hit him. <laughs> so Cypher Phoenix with a two stock, SD from Two Saint, of course, good. but the two stock kind of negates that, you know. It was a, a pretty good turnaround. It yeah. started with the SD, but the two stock confirms that it wasn't just because of the SD. Exactly. He, he had an extra stock to spare. Right. So going into game three, I mean, it's kind of neutral momentum. Tuesday gets a counter pick. Old school New York City. Who? Um, every, all four of these people. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ryobi, Jib, Neil Folan. And Kato. <laughs> oh, true. Uh, FD. Yeah, this is... Wait, Toussaint took Cypher Phoenix here. Questionable. Questionable indeed. I mean, there's got to be a, a Dreamland ban, so, like, what's his other option? Battlefield, Battlefield? again? Uh, he won on Battlefield, so... Yes, he can. Fountain? I guess he didn't want Fountain. No. He said, give me space instead of uh, platforms. In best of fives, I know that Toussaint goes to FD before. He doesn't... Sure. Totally mind FD. He'll ban usually Pokemon instead of FD. He keeps a demon. Uh, so this game, this game's turning out really interesting. Um, Cypher Phoenix with that. He's, he's found the good balance between going in and running away to attack on damage. Yep. And compared to this big game, like I would have thought this was the same set as like this big kid set. It's like any he would have done this to any pub. Yep. Okay. Nice edge guard. Good edge. Really important edge guard to hit there. Considering he doesn't normally go off stage that much, also. It's two? It, two it, at least in these last two sets. Yeah, he hasn't gone like deep down. We haven't seen it yet. He's just done hits at ledge. Oh, like, he's coming go anywhere, though. Two, two doesn't give a foot. Oh, he's dangerous. Oh, dude. It's literally the second time. 
He also did that, fr funny he enough, he did that did in that a friendly. Last? We played one friendly today and he did the same exact thing. I had, it's I'm the same. I've seen uh, Big Kid go for the same one. So he just air dodges under under no like pressure. Just I'm going for it. Look, we all we, we should start blaming something. It's weird. UCF or whatever. Definitely not UCF. <laughs> <laughs> I, I will. Okay, a few bears to catch him. Oh, oh, that's a tough one though. I think reverse fair would have been better. It's dangerous though, because he didn't clean up that stock, and now it's at a point where like he could just lose his stock instead. True. This game hangs in the balance. Was he going to ledge there? I don't know. That was a good arbitrary. He might have been able to slide up over it. Cypher Phoenix. Keeping, oh, keeping things together. The the hash attack. Not enough to kill. Oh. Wow. Oh my god. Double Betrayed. kill. The trade this for last is, stock, game three. This is wild. Okay, here we go. They're both gonna take as much respawn time as they can. Yeah, they're here. both tryharding. This is this is legit. They came back. This is for winner side top eight. This is so tied. Cyber Phoenix small advantage. Couple lasers. Wait, is this it? Wait. Wow. Does this mean it's possible to see a puff ditto on the loser side of yeah, this bracket? Yeah, now we got a puff ditto. <laughs>